Hey guys, Lon from Ecom Zone, and in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how you can clone any section from any website and put it on your Shopify store for free using Sidekick AI tool offered by Shopify. Completely free tool, you don't need an app, you don't need to download anything, you don't need a paid theme. Super simple, it doesn't take long. So first thing you wanna do is go on Shopify online store, any theme, I'm using a Flora theme for this um, website here, click customize, and then you wanna head over to your product page. Now you can actually create sections on your homepage too. It's super simple. Like let's just say you're on popring.com's website and you kinda of want this section here, right? Now you can literally just screenshot it and then give it to ChatGPT, ask for a prompt. I don't really wanna do this one. I kinda of want a, a more complex one. Uh, so let's go over to the product page. So if we scroll down here, you can see how it works and then loved by 200,000 plus pets and humans. So this is like a featured review carousel that I strongly suggest you have on your homepage and product pages. And to add this, you don't really have a section. I mean, Judge Me does offer it, but it's really bad. Like the images are really small. They're not this big, they're unclear, and you can't select your own images. So this is why I kind of use Sidekick AI's tool to create my own. So what you're gonna do is just screenshot this section here, like this. You're gonna bring it over to ChatGPT and you're just gonna paste it in like this. So I've already got it here, pasted the image, and I go generate a prompt for Shopify Sidekick AI tool to create a section that looks like this. And then it gives you the prompt. So here's the prompt and you're just gonna copy this prompt Go over to Shopify, and then once you're on Shopify, you wanna head over to your product page. So up here, we got default product. And decline that, and then if we go down, you can see we have these sections here already. So we've got video gallery, uh, we've got this uh, payment icons, and then we've got a banner here with a 70-30 split. So 70% is text, 30% is image or video. And so let's create another section. So to open Psychic AI, it's just this little icon here, this little face. And what you're gonna do is just paste in that prompt from ChatGPT, and you also wanna get that image too. So just copy that image and paste that in. Now, a few points I do like to mention and add to this prompt is make it mobile responsive, make it swipeable, left, right, up and down on mobile. The reason why I put all directions is because if you have it just swipe all left and right on mobile, when users try to swipe up, it won't let it swipe like down or up because it's only um, made to go left and right. So put that in and then also make the images of each featured review a square. With, yeah, and on mobile, I only want one card displayed on the page. Something like that, and then you just click this purple arrow, and then it'll generate this. So just wait a minute, and it should generate. So I'll create a Shopify theme section for customer reviews with the exact layout and functionality you described. This will be a swipeable carousel that's fully responsive and easy to update, perfect. I've seen you already in the theme editor, I'll generate a custom Shopify section that matches your exact specifications. And so this is what it includes. So free cards on desktop, one on mobile. So we actually want more than free cards. So we want uh, to feature 10 reviews. And then, yeah, just add that in because you do want to add more than three reviews in this section here. Cool, uh, and then you can just review this. And then you just click this button here, and bring you to here, and then click send. Now it's actually gonna create you the code, which is actually insane. Like, honestly, like UX UI designers, coders, software engineers, most of them are probably cooked, like front end designers. It's just insane. This AI bot here has basically replaced them because you don't need to pay anyone. You just need to know how to write good prompts so that it spits out uh, a really professional looking section for your website. So it takes about 
one to two minutes for it to generate the code. So, uh, I don't know. <laughs> we just sit here and watch. So yeah, I hope you guys are still crushing it with your Shopify stores. If you have any questions about your store or dropshipping or your ads, do let me know in the comment section below and I will try to reply as soon as possible. Um, Q4 is around the corner, so you should be preparing for Black Friday, Christmas, even Halloween, because a lot of shoppers will be spending their money in Q4. So you wanna plan ahead, get those banners created, those ads created, think about the offers, your ad copy, and just get them all ready so you're not in a rush when Black Friday comes. So let's close this and then let's see what it's generated. So loved by 200,000 pets and their humans. I need to zoom out a bit. It's like this and then, so it actually has the highlights. So we could be loved by over 100,000 customers worldwide. And then title size, we'll probably reduce that. And then actually, before we even start editing all this and adding images and text and reviews, we actually wanna check if the functions work. So this actually works. So that's good. Now on mobile, does it work? Now the thing with mobile, you do need to check on your phone. So this one doesn't work as well. So you can see like it's cutting into each card and it's not fully displaying each card on the screen which is a problem that I had when I first generated something like this on my own store. And you just kind of have to keep giving it a prompt to fix that. So the first thing we're gonna do is enlarge those images because we want the image to look like this, right? So one, make the image size the full width of the box and let us adjust the height of the image. Then two, Mobile needs to display each, uh, display only one card on the screen um, and it should not get cut off or something like that. And then let's send that because that is quite annoying. And then again, we have to wait for the code to generate. Okay, so it's generated the uh, section again. Let's switch back to desktop. Okay, so that works. Let's see on mobile. Oh, I think it's fixed it. Yeah, I think it has. Nice. Now, the only thing I don't like about the desktop version is that it's a full width section, um, which is annoying. I mean, just for the sake of this video, I'm gonna keep it, but essentially you just wanna keep giving it instructions so that it's perfect for what you want. But yeah, so we'll just leave it as this and we're just gonna change this to customers worldwide. Change this down and then image height. Look at that, we can even adjust the image heights. So usually you kind of want it like this because the images that your customers will provide usually is in a square or vertical image. So ideally you want a bigger height for your images. Now background, title, highlighted background. Now this should fit your theme. So if it's like blue, then it should be highlighted blue. If it's green, then it's green, etc. Style color, that should be your theme as well. Verify badge. And then if we go down, here we are. So we could type your review here, your, your name and your customer image, and then rating five. And you just keep adding your reviews. So that is how you clone a section onto your website. Super simple. It literally takes what took me 10 minutes to generate and you don't need to pay for any apps. You don't need to pay for any devs. You don't need to pay for a paid theme. It, everything is done with Sidekick AI. The only problem that I have right now is trying to create a video gallery like this. So I've generated this video gallery, but every time I try to upload an MP4 file or MOV file, it just doesn't want to play. And I'm not too sure why. I mean, if anyone has experimented with this uh, video gallery and found a fix for it, do let us know and I'll make another video for it. But honestly, I don't know why it's not working. So what has worked for me is a GIF gallery. So it's like video GIFs, uh, which is very easy to make. You just go on CapCut, you export as a GIF. So that's fine. Another workaround is YouTube links. 
So instead of providing videos, you provide a YouTube link and that also works. But the thing with YouTube links is very clunky. So that's why I would prefer GIF galleries. So yeah, that's how you clone your sections. And then over here is your section here. Now let's just say you want this section to go on the home page. So let's actually rename this. This is featured uh, reviews. So let's just say you want to clone this onto your home page. What you're going to do is copy, go onto your home page, and then add section, paste. And then there we have it. It's at is on your home page now. Super simple. It's a slick feature that Shopify recently added where you can copy and paste sections. Uh, the other downside of Psychic AI is that you can't actually add stuff into this product information. It's very annoying and it, like you see here, you can't drag it into it. So the product information is kind of just locked off for Sidekick AI. You can't actually add custom things into it. It only depends on what your theme offers. And that's why it's actually best to stick with the Dawn theme or the Horizon theme because Shopify is moving to the Horizon theme and that's what they're focusing most of their time on building. So yeah, either use the Dawn theme or the Horizon theme and that there guys is how you clone any section from any website onto your own website for free using AI. If you found this video valuable, smash that like button, subscribe to my channel for more content and peace.